I must state that for safety, honesty and cautious reasons, the information in this video was gathered through research on the internet. I am not telling you to do anything in particular. Your choices are of your own volition. Seek medical advice for further knowledge. What is visceral obesity? The abnormally high deposition of visceral adipose tissue is known as visceral obesity. Visceral adipose tissue is an hormonally active component of total body fat, which possesses unique biochemical characteristics that influence several normal pathological processes in the human body. How do I tell if I have visceral fat? Visceral or abdominal fat is the fat stored deep within the abdominal cavity surrounding vital organs. While it's the type of fat you can't see or feel directly, you can get an idea of whether you have excess visceral fat through a few methods. Measuring your waist circumference is a good indicator, as is your waist to hip ratio also. Additionally, your body shape, apple versus pear, can suggest whether or not you're more likely to store fat in your abdomen. The waist circumference, what it means. For women, a waist circumference of 35 inches or 89 centimeters or more, and for men, 40 inches, which is 102 centimeters or more, suggests an increased risk of health problems related to visceral fat. Do not cheat yourself. Try not to suck in your stomach when measuring your waist circumference. What it means? A ratio higher than 0.85 for women and a measurement at 0.90 for men indicates an increased risk of health issues associated with abdominal fat. Body appearance in shape. An apple looking body type. If you tend to store more fat in the abdominal area, giving you an apple shape, you are more likely to have excess visceral fat. Pear looking body type. But if you tend to store more fat in your hips and thighs, you are more likely to have subcutaneous fat under the skin.